Hi, we're standing outside an amazing mansion in Cornwall Hill Estate. It is perched right on top of the hill. It is an amazing property with amazing 360 views of the city. Come and have a look and fall in love. What we have here is a formal entrance that leads you into an internal courtyard framed on both sides by the house. On the left is uh, the kitchen family room area and on the right is where our garages will be situated. And then you walk straight into the formal entrance hall. So you can spiral staircase. You can impress your guests with it. And of course uh, you can uh, seat them here in the formal entrance area whilst awaiting to be welcomed into the dining position. All the doors of this property open onto either the courtyards, there the are two internal courtyards, or into the garden space from every direction. Back into the entrance hall, the house is divided into two wings and to the left we have the entertainment areas. So we're going to walk into the dining room now and have a look at what it has to offer. Right from the start I'm impressed by this gorgeous dining room table. Solid wood and uh, leather and steel chairs. It's a 10 seater but can easily turn into a 12 seater. It is a massive space and the table remains with the property. It is simply too big and too heavy to be removed. So that is a bonus. We have a um, gas fireplace that opens from the dining room as well as the lounge area, heating the entire space. The entire property also has um, music throughout and in certain places we have um, fireplaces and we also have underfloor heating upstairs. Built-in cabinetry as a server to the dining room and from the dining room we walk into the lounge, the formal lounge area framed by windows with beautiful curtains and with doors swinging open and sliding open into the courtyard and into the second entertainment area which is this massive enclosed patio you can see it is divided into two studies a seating area and the building bar area so you easily have a space of three to four rooms into one there is a built-in bar here as well as another gas fireplace that's also air conditioning it has to be noted that everything in this property has been freshly painted so everything is in perfect condition we have aluminium doors and windows throughout and internally we have white Hampton style wooden frames. And following the same flow, we can just walk around that courtyard with the koi pond and walk back towards the living space, which is another uh, formal lounge area, You're easily used as a TV room or a cinema room. It also has white built-in cabinets uh, along the one wall and it has a gas fireplace and doors leading to the garden as well. Through the double doors we walk back into the main passage and you will find to the left a guest toilet and uh, the doors from our garages and a little storeroom or should I even say quite a big storeroom, it's a walk-in storeroom to put your stuff right after you climb out of your car. We have six garages in total three double door garages. From the garage back into the passage and follow me now to see of course the most important room in every house, the kitchen. Through the dining room and into the kitchen space. An absolutely gorgeous kitchen, white cabinetry, natural stone tops, an oven, uh, smeg appliances, built-in, several ovens and microwaves, a smeg coffee machine. It is really a beautiful setup. Plenty of cupboard space, you can see. The kitchen owl is uh, quite uh, large as well and it is right next to a sunny, beautiful family sitting and dining area. 
all of which open with a sliding door to the first courtyard that we walked through when we entered this gorgeous property. And usually the scullery is not so important or we never really give it much attention, but I think this scullery is absolutely worthy of giving a special attention. Look at the number of cupboards that you have here. Surely you'll be able to fit all your knickknacks in. There is also a walk-in pantry, space for a double fridge, and space for a laundry room for your big laundry machines. Very nice farm style kitchen sink as well. There are multiple skylights throughout the house. So even the scullery has been uh, graced with uh, three skylights giving it a lot of natural light. What is quite nice is that the kitchen is open plan. However, you have these sliding doors that can be closed off and give you the privacy if you are doing a formal dinner whilst your guests are seated in the formal dining section. Natural rock, heated swimming pool, beautifully maintained wooden deck with space for four lounges and breakfast area for your table to enjoy the stunning view. Now that we have seen the living spaces downstairs that comprise of two separate living rooms, massive enclosed patio, full more dining and a gorgeous, gorgeous kitchen, let's head upstairs and have a look what the upstairs section has to offer. Up the symmetrical spiral staircase, the house is divided into two sections again, everything is symmetrical. So we're going to start from the one end and head all the way around this circular passage have a look at all the rooms. Multiple storage units have been built along the walls wherever possible. All of the bedrooms are generous with own suite bathrooms. Bedroom number one, king size four poster bed, built-in cabinetry along the side, two seating areas, air conditioner, walk-in closet and a full bathroom. The American shutters here and the bedroom also leads you to a massive balcony which we will have a look at shortly. Out bedroom number one, right next to it is situated a massive study area, double swing doors, wall-to-wall built-in wooden white cabinets, Again, an aircon, central pipe music, and plenty of space for a desk and a seating area, as well as a balcony overlooking the arena. We're heading towards bedroom number two. Of course, it can easily serve as a master bedroom once again. It's got a beautiful lounge area looking into the full bathroom en suite, and it has a massive king size bed built-in cabinetry alongside the wall and access to the scenic balcony. We're looking at the front of the property here. We can see the um, main entrance of the property with the massive driveway and it also has a driveway leading straight into the stables for your supply. You can have a look at the arena and uh, the land ring where the horses can exercise. Really beautiful scenic view here. And this balcony is shared by the second bedroom as well as the master bedroom. Up 
after seeing the two bedrooms on suite and the study area, we now head into the left side of the wing where we find the third bedroom and the master bedroom as well as the gym area, bedroom number three. What is quite nice is that each bedroom has its own distinct character. This bedroom, for example, has um, light grey cabinetry. The other bedrooms had white cabinetry, but they're all very generous rooms, all with plenty of windows and every single bathroom, apart from being a full bathroom, is also fitted with skylights. A lot of natural sun coming into the bathrooms, making them nice and warm in winter time as well. And of course, a house like this has to have a gym area. Have a look at the gym. Fully fitted with a lot of cupboards right across it as well to serve as linen cupboards or maybe just to store some additional gym equipment. Also fitted with an air conditioner. And of course the most important room in the house after the kitchen, the master bedroom. Spa-like feel in the bathroom and not two but three shower heads. Enough space for quite a few people to fit in whether you want to or not. Plenty of cupboards along the entire wall here. Stunning scenic bath, jet bath and a lot more cabinets in that walk-in closet leading straight ahead of us. All in white with a natural stone. I think this is Travertine. And there's a dressing room area here as well. The toilet is private and it's fitted with a bidet as well as a toilet. Master bedroom fitted with um, air conditioning as well as a gas fireplace, lounge area and a king size bed area. Also fitted cupboards on the side there for some additional storage over and above the massive walk-in closet that we just see and access to that beautiful scenic balcony we just saw that um, led out of the second bedroom as well. Throughout the house, high ceilings, downstairs as well as upstairs. This is easily more than three and a half meter ceilings. It, the feeling of comfort, warmth and uh, volume, it is just incredible. It is a very stately, very generously proportioned house and it is really in a beautiful condition. Such a beautiful family home. It is a stately home. It is built with quality and Cornwall Hill is one of the best areas to be in. It is uh, managed beautifully. It is super safe. It gives you all the space of a hectare plus property. You can run and cycle here and uh, enjoy the space and the tranquility you get in the middle of the city, just minutes away from the highways and all major shopping centers. I'm really glad that I have the opportunity to present you this gorgeous home.